But are we allowing these satellites, but yet keeping like letting people have a monopoly in one spot, and so they get to open the satellites, but nobody else gets the chance to open up? This is only a monopoly per area. And uh, certainly somebody could say it is a monopoly in that district, but if somebody really wants to, uh, all they got to do is go to a different district that, that could be very near them and they could go buy from a pharmacy in that area if the other one's too uh, too expensive. It's unfair for us to come in and change the rules in the middle of the game. And Whoever had these licenses sure doesn't want to share it with anybody else. I don't I blame do them. understand the importance of uh, businesses who invested in this to have an opportunity to recoup their investment and to and to make some money. So how did you determine that two satellites was an appropriate amount to allow that business owner to recoup his investment? There is none right now that could have two satellites immediately. I'm trying to figure out what's their investment. What is the initial investment by a pharmacy owner that deals with medical marijuana so that we know what's a fair number of satellites to allow them to have to recoup their investment? To Senator Morris's point, they have a corner on the market for a certain period of time until they get to a certain threshold of business. And so what is their investment? I, I don't honestly know the answer to that. Maybe some others could give you a better answer to that. I don't know what it costs to set up one of these. I'm not in that business, have no idea. So then you can't really defend, is it, is it fair? But is it fair to have two satellites or is it more fair to have one? If I'm one of those nine business owners, I'd want to have as many satellites as possible. It seems like there should be some fiscal analysis of what's the right number on that. And I don't know if that was ever Senator done. Why is government guaranteeing or wants to guarantee a return on investment in this market for these folks? So we're not guaranteeing anything. We're not guaranteeing any return on investment. We're giving them an opportunity to recoup their investment before we open this up any further. But we're limiting competition by doing this, correct? So the competition was limited when all of this was first put into place. It was established. That's not what we're doing now. It's already in place. It's been in place since we first started doing this.